Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to enable a charging LED on your Nexus 6. Now the Nexus 6 uses an ambient display notification system that shows a black and white version of your lock screen when you get a new message. That's because the device has an AMOLED screen, which uses virtually no power to display black pixels. As a result, the Nexus 6 doesn't show a blinking LED light for new notifications like most Android phones. But the Nexus 6 does indeed have a notification LED. It's hidden under the top speaker grill and has simply been disabled on the software side of things. In the past, I've covered a method to enable this LED for incoming notifications, which involve using the pro version of an app called Lightflow. But Lightflow only works for notifications on the Nexus 6. It doesn't turn on the LED while you're charging your phone. For me, this feature is really helpful. I use wireless charging almost exclusively, so having the LED turn on while charging lets me know that the phone and the charging pad are lined up properly. Well, a new app from developer KDB will actually allow you to enable the hidden LED on your Nexus 6 while your device is charging. It even has a few more triggers, like display on, Bluetooth enabled, and storage access. To get this one going, your Nexus 6 will need to be rooted, but if you need any help with that part, just check out my article on Gadget Hacks. The app is called LED Control Root, and a free version is available on the Google Play Store. So search it by name to get it installed, then we'll check out the setup process. Now when you first launch LED Control, the app will inform you that it needs to request root access. So tap Next on this message, then hit Grant on the Super User Access request. From here, start by turning on the master switch at the top of the screen. When you do that, you'll see a list of available LED triggers. These are conditions that if met will cause your hidden LED light to be turned on. So you can opt to enable the LED when your phone is charging, when it's full, when it's connected to a USB source, and so on. So pick the trigger that works best for you. Then you'll see a toast message saying that you need to connect the phone to a charger before your changes will become active. As a bonus, you can even control the brightness of your LED with this slider at the top of the screen. Again though, you'll need to plug in your charger before you'll see any changes, so let me grab one of those. So after plugging in the charger, you can see that my hidden notification LED has now been activated. Since I chose wild charging as my trigger, this will continue to happen every time I plug in my charger. But if you reboot your phone, you'll have to open the LED control app and turn on the master switch again. That's actually a limitation of the free version. So if you want this to be enabled automatically on boot, you'll have to purchase the pro version for 99 cents. If you go that route, open the app and hit the three dot menu button. From here, just tick the box next to set on boot and LED control will always be enabled. Another cool pro feature is this LED color option, which lets you choose from three different colors if you're not a fan of the default green. So the free version is obviously very capable, but the pro version adds a bit more to the mix. For the full breakdown though, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time folks, but until then, happy gadget hacking!